one of the factors of 2x cubed plus 42x squared plus 208x is x plus b, where b is a positive constant. What is the smallest possible value of b? Okay, so we need to factor this expression here. So let's find some factors. So let's take out a 2x common out, since all of these terms have a 2x in them. So the first term will become just x squared. The second term will become 21x. And the third term will become 104. This will just give back the original equation, but we factored out a 2x. OK, so in here, this looks like a quadratic. And we can just factor this by grouping. So we'll just factor this alone. So we need to split this middle term into two terms whose coefficients, when multiplied together, will equal 104. So those two numbers are 8 and 13. So we'll split 21x into 8x plus 13x, which equals 21x. But now the coefficient of the x terms, 8 and 13, when multiplied together, equal 1 times 104. And this splitting of the x term will allow us to factor by grouping. Here, you'll see it here. When we factor out an x from these first two terms, we'll be left with x plus 8. And then we can factor out a 13 from these two terms. So when we factor out a 13, the first term is just x, and the second term will be an 8. OK, now we see that this x plus 8 quantity is common to both of these terms. So we can factor this 8x plus 8 from both. So when we do that, let's go up here. We'll be left with an x plus 8 on the outside. And then we'll be multiplying x plus 8 with an x and a 13. So x plus 13. OK, so then let's plug this factored expression back into our original equation, our expression. So we'll have 2x times x plus 8 plus, and then x plus 13. So this is completely factored form of our original expression up here. OK, and we need to find factors that are of the form x plus b. So x plus some constant. So only these two are of the form x plus some constant. Here, this is x plus 8 and this is x plus 13. This factor here is just a, a constant being multiplied with x. It's not of the form x plus b, so we won't consider this one. So here we have x plus 8 as a factor and x plus 13. And the question asked us for the smallest possible value of b. So b can either be 8 or b can either be 13. But we need the smallest possible value of b, so we'll make we'll choose 8 as our answer. So the answer is 8 for the smallest possible value of b.